Hello and welcome. I'm the Autistic Modeler, and today we're going to be building a 1964 F100 by AMT. Come on over here. Let's get started. Okay, well, first of all, let's take a look at that box. That's some neat artwork. I really like that vintage-looking package. Pretty cool. Full trailer included. And this is a 1960 model Ford F100. And uh, I understand that this was copied from an original to remake the tooling because the original tool is gone for whatever reason. And uh, I believe it is an exact copy of the original. But either way, it's new and it's back for us to build. So let's see here. Well, there's that trailer right there. There's some custom stuff that comes with it. Toolbox, gas can, fire extinguisher, lug wrencher, trophy. That's neat. Right here. There's our engine. Looks like a Y-Block Ford 292 to me. I've owned a lot of them over the years. And I really like this version. I think this is what we're going to do. I like that. There's our decal sheet. All right, let's take a look at what we got. Here we go. All right, well, here's some of that trailer parts right here. There's our wheels. And our hitch. And the ramps. Fenders there. Pretty cool. And then there's, like, the chassis for the trailer. Pretty neat. This is the push bumper for the, uh... Like the gas station truck version. And then here's the uh, base of the trailer here. Parts of it. And there's our, it looks like we get two chrome trees. Pretty cool. There's our stock hubcaps. Our grill, front and rear bumpers. It's like a little, I think that's an air filter. I'm not sure. Some lake pipes. Custom grill work, mirrors, and there's some uh, like little custom hubcaps. This is really cool looking. I like the vintage 60s look to it. There's some more of those custom hubcaps. There's that trophy. That's cool. I like these little mag wheels. Pretty cool. Tri-power. Some horns. Chrome valve covers a torque wrench how about that that's interesting here's our clear pieces we got like a red emergency lens some custom tail lights there separate window glass headlamps lenses there and there's our bed look how nice that looks i like that ford logo on there good stuff Nice looking. There's the cab. It says in here, custom cab right there. Hood opens. Radiator there. In full detail. Really nice. I like this. Very nice. Oh, it even has a tonneau cover for the rear. And there's our, our uh, skirts for the custom version. Our bottom of our bed. Nice. There's the hood. Steering wheel, fan, uh, radiator hose. Dashboard looks really good. You see that? Looks really good. I like that. Nice seat. It has half of some design on it. Interior looks really good. It's got nice engravings on the side. Our chassis. The exhaust is molded in, but we can detail it up very nicely. Our, uh, looks like our manifolds there. Maybe a custom uh, roll pan or part of the cab. I'm not sure. Our belt and pulley, a horn. And there's our wheels. Uh, wheel backs. That's what those are. And here's our battery. We got two different batteries. Not exactly sure what that's about. I don't know. There's our toolbox. Fire extinguisher. Like intake and cylinder heads are made in one piece. It's kind of interesting looking. 
radiator, and then our engine halves, gasoline cans, custom louvers. That's pretty cool for a custom version. Part of the firewall there. Nice. And then here's our axle rods. Got two for the truck, one for the trailer. Don't lose those. And our tires. Now, as you can see, we got white wall. We're going to have four of these and then two of these for the trailer. Okay. Okay. And then here's our book. Our book right here. And the decals. Decals are really neat. I really like that. It says Ray's Automotive. Pretty cool. I like that. And then here's, take a look at this book here. Nice, easy assembly. There's a strap for the fire extinguisher. There's some flasher unit and stuff. This is really cool. Oh, you could put the side pipes or you could do them up and down for like a big truck. Interesting. Let's, go, let's open this up. Let's take a look at this. Really cool. Be sure you look your uh, book over for whatever version you decide to do. And a basic engine assembly and interior. Really cool. Now here's the book for the trailer. Now, it says the trailer can be built two different ways because it can be a display base without the wheels. And there's a certain way to build that right here. And then there's our regular trailer with our wheels and everything and whatnot. So, uh, all right, well, let's decide how we're going to do ours. And I'll be right back. The Autistic Modeler is proud to be partnered with Round 2 Models. The makers of great kits from AMT, MPC, and Polar Lights. Get yours today.
Well, all right, it's that time again. That's right, final assembly. Let's take a look how far we come. Right away, look at this cab. That's neat. This is going to be a neat service station truck, huh? Love those colors. That orange and that blue turned out great. And there's the bed. It's ready to go. I really like how this turned out. That marker turned out good. And there's our white walls. You saw how I soaked them in the warm tap water there for about a minute. And then uh, slid them over the tires. Turned out pretty good. And there's our trailer tires. We did the same thing with them. Our trailers ready to go. Our chrome bits for the emblems and some other things on the vehicle. And there's our Y block Ford with the three carburetors. The chrome valve covers turned out really sweet. There's a fire extinguisher, our red light for the top, tail lights, and whatnot. And the interior is really good. Look at that. Dashboard it turned out phenomenal with those decal gauges. Some small detail to the doors. Really cool. And then there's some batteries. One goes in the back. And then uh, we'll be able to finish this up. When we come back, we'll do our final review. Stick with me. Well, all right, here we go. All finished. The 1960 Ford F100 by AMT. This was an awesome build. I really enjoyed it. I didn't have any trouble putting things together. Follow the instruction book. It's very simple and makes a great model kit. Well, let's take a look at it. First, let's take a look at that engine. They kind of hot rotted there up their 292 V8 engine in there. Those three carburetors and stuff. And I added a little moon eyes on there and road service and golf. And it came with all this like road service tools, a battery, a fire extinguisher, toolbox. I put some of the spare decals on there. Gasoline and diesel cans, four-way. Flip it around here. And it came with those great looking decals for the for the dashboard. There's the underneath. Pretty basic, but it went together great. The engine fit together great. You saw how I painted the Ford on the back. The tires were a little bit of a trick bag, but I showed you how to heat those up and get them on there on the tire with a little warm water. And there's our pretty neat little trailer. We could put anything on that. That was pretty cool. Hooks on there just like that. Pretty simple stuff. Well, I'm so glad round two sent us over for a full build and review. So until next time, I'm the autistic modeler. Happy modeling.